and girls of the shaft. <laughs> hey, how's it going, everybody? I'm really pissed off right now. And I'm here <laughs> with everybody, the lovely squeaky girl, Xenia. Xenia, are you also really angry right now? I am really freaking angry right now. Uh, so we're both really <laughs> angry. And now I'm laughing, but we're really angry. We're really frustrated, but it's okay. We got to show up and we got to do this anyway. Check it out, guys. Actually, Zenica, what just happened? So we were streaming and that's kind of why we're a little bit pissy right now. But we were just streaming. And what what, what happened when we were streaming, Xenia? You want to you wanna lead us in on this one? Well, the moment we pressed play on the stream, Ark decided they wanted to raise a new dossier for Aberration. <gasps> <laughs> yeah, I know. How frustrating. Is that kind of frustrating or what? Like, really? <laughs> Great timing, guys. Right? Like, you had to you had to do this. So, once again, I'm taking Xenia under my wing, and I'm forcing her in front of the mic. You can see that she's getting better and better every video. She's, she's becoming a real, really something special. I know she's going to oh. nail it with her little... Uh, what, what is it, audition that you're doing? I know you're going to nail it. We're going to get you really good. All right, so girl, let's do this. So what what are, you, what are we looking at here, girl? What is this thing, huh? A gecko butterfly thing. A gecko butterfly? That's actually a pretty smart... It's pretty good, actually. I didn't even know what to call this thing, but a gecko butterfly. How cool. So we got a gecko butterfly thing here, and what do you make of this, girl? What are you, what are you thinking, huh? adorable looking and it looks like it's gonna be so tiny and cute you think it's adorable <laughs> well i think it's through adorable. my lenses of pure rage right now i'm just looking at this thing and i hate it like if this thing were on my desk in front of me right now i'd be tempted to just grab it in between my hands and just squish it Aww, until it just, it's just it's so it's a little head popped i'd just crush it under my boot right now because <laughs> this thing i don't want to see cute things right now and this thing is cute, and I don't want to see it right now. <laughs> 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 so, we got a gecko butterfly thing, and what I'm going to add here, I mean, there's not a whole lot to talk about. I mean, we just got a gecko, and we've got not much. It's got wings. It's got a little long tail. You can tell. Look at the scale of this image. Look at how big the gecko is in this image. Based on that and that there's no point of reference in the image we can tell that this gecko thing is tiny this is a tiny little insignificant creature i know it's going to be tiny this is something i'm going to tell you right now it's pretty obvious this is something that's going to sit on your shoulder and this little gecko thing is one of the three cute little creatures in in uh aberration that we're going to see so we have the lantern pug we've got whatever this thing is that means there's one final cute creature left to be revealed. And that means currently, how many creatures do we know, girl? In, in, in oh. aberration. So I think in my video, I said we had a count of five, right? It was five or six. I think it was five creatures that we had not seen yet. So with this new creature that we're looking at right now, that means that there are only four creatures left for us to see. Now, actually, there was like a light bug in the trailer, and I'm not sure if that counts as one of the creatures. If it does, and that's horribly disappointing. That means there's only three creatures left for us to see. How dis I mean, I'm, I'm kind of disappointed. Like, I'm hoping these last three creatures are going to be some really doink-looking doink creatures in general. Like, I want something beastly. Like, I want a titan that glows with wings and fangs. That's what I want. I want a world-eating creature. I want something crazy. Isn't there supposed to be a boss in this, girl? Yeah, I believe so. So if there's Hopefully a boss, that and that would probably take up... It doesn't count? I don't think it does. I mean, I can't imagine it would, because it's not really going to be a tameable creature. Okay. So then, with this... I mean... Well, what do you think? What do you think this is going to be good for? Probably fetching things on walls because geckos are known for going up walls. Oh, okay, that's smart. But it's also got wings. Okay, so like everything else in the game, this is probably, you know, look at it. So geckos can climb on walls. It also has wings. So everything in this game seems to have 
everything in aberration seems to have the ability to climb on walls and everything in aberration i mean everything in aberration seems to have the ability to get around quick so this thing looks like it's you know if you have it set to follow or something it'll be able to follow you up walls it'll be able to glide to you whatever so this thing's going to be great all terrain but what does it do i what does it do girl throw it to me it looks useless it does look <laughs> useless and that's why i hate these small little stupid creatures i have a I, mean, I love how cute it is but it looks useless i have like a weird feeling that its little ability to sit on walls and stuff is going to play in like i just get this vibe with this creature that this is going to be like a base defender like you can stick this on your wall or something and it's going to have the ability to like alert you or maybe it like emits a poison gas or something, right? Because aren't geckos like poisonous? I don't believe geckos are actually. No? I don't think I could be wrong. <laughs> what does it I do? I mean, maybe it's going to be annoying to just latch onto your face or something. That'd be kind of cute. Okay, I could see that. I enemies. I'm kind of getting the, I mean, you know what, maybe it just like produces some kind of weird material because isn't there like some dark matter material or something? So maybe it just is going to produce that material passively or have the ability to get that. Yeah, that's probably what it is. It's probably going to have like, for example, the Ichthyornis or some of the other shoulder mounted creatures. They do have their specialty. So this one's probably going to be something like it's either going to be maybe base defense or it's going to collect some sort of new material and be efficient for that like all of the other what was that it could be the new jabella and just warn you of the different oh. like earthquakes oh <gasps> i think you nailed it i could totally see that this is probably the new the new jerboa because everybody loved the jerboa and i wouldn't be surprised if you know they were purposely going to create a unique jerboa for every dlc expansion pack that way we're alerted and we know when one of these crazy Disasters are going to happen. Boom, girl. <gasps> you just yes. nailed it. <laughs> Good job. I think he, I think she nailed it, guys. If you, What do you think this thing does? Let me know in the comments. But that's what I'm thinking. I think she nailed it. So what are people saying about this anyway? I'm curious. Let's take a look at the comments. And what do we got? We got more complaints, complaints. just like the last one. <laughs> Oh, that's interesting. Someone's sort of theorizing that it's going to be a shoulder mount that acts as a glow-in-the-dark wingsuit. I kind of doubt that, but that'd be kind of cool. Uh, cool. Yay. More complaints. Someone thinks it's a wyvern. That's an interesting Dragonfly one. wyvern? Eh. Why are people thinking this is the rock drake? This is not the rock drake. Not even close. It's going to be a shoulder-mounted creature, of course. Let's see. Yeah, some people think it's a gecko glider. More complaints, more complaints. Okay, well, nothing really exciting in the Twitter comments. What do we got on their actual official forum? So there we go, we got this again. The big dossier. I wish that they would have shown us more. Actually, wait a minute. So if this is representing, if this is supposed to represent the entire dossier page, this space, this square, then this must not be a very like in-depth dossier that means this thing probably must not do much at all <laughs> okay let's let's scroll down here so what are people saying okay kind of annoying blah 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 and there is nothing relevant there <laughs> How about the steam community does anybody have any idea what this is or what it does some Let's people are see. saying it's going to be toothless. Some, some people are saying what? It's going to be toothless. It's not going to have any teeth. I can see that. I don't really see why it would matter. Cool. More complaints. <laughs> as usual. Okay. Let's see. OMG, this is the coolest creature ever. That makes the Jerboa second place. All right. Well, people are comparing this to the Jerboa. Yes, indeed. More complaints and a first comment, of course. Right, <laughs> so guys, <laughs> as we saw last time, there is not a whole lot of discussion going on on this creature as of yet. Well, I mean, I'm kind of out of things to say. What about you, girl? You got anything else to add? Yeah. 
I, I got nothing. It's, I'm just finding complaints. <laughs> just you. It's just your whole life is just complaints. It is. Oh, uh, okay. Well, there's not a lot to go off of here. So let me know what you guys think in the comments down below. Tell me your theories. I've told you mine. Tell me yours. Do me a favor. Share this video with your pals. And with that, I, I think I'm out, everybody. It's been fun doing another 1 a.m. video. I'm looking forward to more 1 a.m. videos soon. If you're new here, make sure you subscribe as well. All right, girl. Go ahead. Do it. I'm out. I'm out. Do it again. I'm out. You gotta be cool. I'm out. I'm out. Good enough. All right. Later, everybody. <laughs>